Hi everyone, this is Jennifer and I'm here with a video <clears throat> to showcase the first place prize for Teresa Creations um, sub 4,000 subscriber giveaway. And uh, so I will link Teresa's original video um, to the, in the links below so you can see what exactly the, um, the giveaway is and I was um, in charge of making the first place prize and is this is it. It's an embellishment box. Um, the theme for this is more of like a butterfly garden theme so that's why it's like that. Then um, I'm going to show you the contents of it. So, <clears throat> so go to Teresa Creations channel um, subscribe if you haven't already and just follow her instructions to be entered to win this um, embellishment box. So it just looks like this in the front. A couple of die cuts and wood pieces that I've uh, altered and some trim and flowers on there and some butterflies. And this is the, oh, my daughter's. <laughs> this is not included. My daughter's just decided to put that in there. Uh, this is what's included. <clears throat> I'll go um, each section at a time. So you're going to get some of these butterflies, flowers, you get a pack of, I won't open everything just so the person who gets it can kind of be surprised, but it's a pack of paper flowers. These ones are from uh, Wild Orchid Crafts. There's another little butterfly. Get some butterfly sequins. This little embellishment that I made. You're gonna get uh, quite a few flowers in here. Here's some little mushrooms. And then flower. These are all paper flowers. These flowers are all from uh, Wild Orchid Crafts mostly. You'll be getting some of this trim, which is the same as the outside, different color. Some of this. You'll be getting some rosette trim, some more of the same trim that's on the outside, and a couple of different laces. You'll be getting these flower embellishments. And in here, I won't open it all, but it's just a bunch of paper flowers. Different colors. And then these are a bunch of flower wood embellishments, some metal ones. You could alter these with like alcohol inks if you have them. And then for the bottoms, <clears throat> I actually did not use the shredded paper because um, I just don't like the look of it. I think it's a little messy. Um, it's it's, you know, preference, I guess. So I use these um, flowers that you can take out. They just have a glue dot at the bottom. You can take that out and reuse that. Um, and they're just big paper. They're kind of like paper fabric flowers. I'm not really sure. But you see it underneath all of them, except these big ones, I have the flowers. Hold everything in place. You could also use... Um, cupcake liners, like mini cupcake liners to put in there. I was going to do that, but I thought the flowers kind of went with the theme better. You'll get some resin pieces, some resin flowers. There's one metal one in there. We'll get a packet. These are from uh, Michael's, is what I used from the front. So besides these, the rest of the flowers are from... Wild Orchid Crafts. Here we get some cute little buttons in different colors. And here's some of the bling that you will get. Just a bunch of different kind of bling.
Hope you can see all that. Also be getting some little sequins. And then you'll be getting this arrangement of flowers. These are beautiful. And then another little bunch of tinier flowers. And then lastly, you'll be getting these uh, handmade, these I made um, butterfly embellishments. So they're all different. Once more glittery. This one that has the acetate. This one here. It's got the glitter paper underneath. So you'll be getting all of those. And then I did make some rosettes, little paper rosettes like this that were actually too big I didn't measure the size correctly, so they're too big to fit in there, but you'll be getting those separately in this little bag. And they're all different, and I'll let you be surprised on exactly how they look when you receive them. So you will be getting that as well. So this is everything in the box. And then also, as a bonus, um, I am actually going to be giving away five different uh, blind bags. So I made some blind bags, and um, the way it's going to work is uh, once Teresa Creations does choose a winner for this embellishment box, she'll also pull additionally five names um, to win it, have a chance to win one of these blind bags. Um, and they're just filled with crafty goodies, so they're basically a mini version of the embellishment box, but in a bag. And uh, what I've done is kind of, you can't really see anything, I've tried to double the bag over. So um, there's just a bunch of little goodies in here, and you will have a chance to win one. So just follow Teresa Creations instructions on her video, and you can have a chance to, if you don't win the grand prize, um, I think she has three prizes, so first, second, and third place, and then you still have a chance to win one of these bags, these blind bags, just filled with goodies. So, thank you for watching. Um, if anything is unclear, or if you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below, or just um, or a comment on Teresa's video. She'll be happy to answer as well. Thank you so much for watching, and I can't wait to see who wins. Thank you. Bye-bye.